I'm going to place you and you in a separate group. And you're going to stand in here. You're going to be hidden. And you're going to wait for the Egyptian fools to try and flank us. And then you'll dislodge them. And you'll dissuade them of their silly plans. You need to stand behind my line like that. Yes, like that. Make sure everyone's not skirmishing. You need to cover my left. Uh, that's a little thin for my liking. Mm. We need more of them to make a line that I like, but that'll do. And cavalry. You guys are going to hang out over there while the general hangs out there. Actually, what I'll do is I'll place them directly behind the line. That way they can go to either side. And hopefully it will all go well. The enemy have brought up more men. Yep. Yeah, we knew that was coming. So, we've used the woods to hide a detachment of our men. Hopefully that comes to some fruition. They should get the javelin shots off. given the way we've deployed them. Um, hmm. I want to dress the line a little bit with these guys. Let's put it a little more like that. And archers a little bit more like that. So they should come in, hopefully, toward our right, assuming that they can get to the archers. If we're lucky, that's how it'll go down. But they have a lot of skirmishers, and I do not like this, not one little bit. But we have to use the hand we're given. So, cavalry to the flank. They're weak in cavalry. We should be able to beat them on that count. And I'm hoping that if we send our cavalry out and smack them hard enough... A lot of the skirmishers will run. Or at the very least get peppered by arrows, so... Let's let the Cretans have a little bit of a, a go at them first. You guys might as well get ready to throw. Yeah, there's no point holding onto our javelins, hoping that we're going to hit something harder. You might as well just chuck. Yes, you are. Get in there. Get in there now. Need you to do some good work. Alright, so they're sending out some mercenary hoplites. We'll probably kill a fair few of them. With our javelins. Yeah. Nice. If we can kill the general, we've pretty much got them. Need you guys to attack that. Nice to attack there too. They should be running. Yeah, they're running. Basically, we're just going to have to hold the line. No, 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 no. Get in there. Wow. They have just, like, chewed through that line. Is that you? No. Seriously, cavalry? Seriously? You're just like getting pincushioned now. God damn. Right, run. Get out of there. Seriously? What the fuck are you doing? Run! <sighs> yep. Yep. Saw that one coming. Where the hell are you? Oh. Oh, you're getting chewed up really hard. Get in there. Really? Oh, they're attacking the Gallic Swordsman. Ooh. Oh, that's my cavalry running. Right. You guys need to cover like that. <sighs> Damn. Well, if we can kill that general, it'll be a lot better for us. Well, assuming he's the commanding general, I suppose. If he's not, then it doesn't make a difference.
Could we please kill him? I'm assuming we got him. Did we get him or not? No, there we go. Got him. Gods be praised. The enemy general is killed. Right. Fear makes a home in our enemy's heart. That should help. Okay, I need you to jump in there and attack to the side. General man, come on. You can do it. No, apparently you can't. Alright, Equites. Get back over this way. Libyan Cav. Get back over this way. You guys, I need you to attack like this. Libyan Cav, get in there. You guys, I need you to focus your fire on these fellows. Where is... Oh, they're just sort of fumbling about over there. Well, I can approve of that. Alright, you guys need to stop firing. What are you doing? Who the hell are you? Oh, well, you know what? Just continue doing your thing. What I want to do is form a new line like this. Equites? Is that you? Yes, it is. Alright, they're all running. Is in flight. Pursue them and drive them from the battlefield. That is a plus. Now we just have to kill them. You need to chase these fellas. Okay, they're splitting up. General, get over here. You two, you're gonna have to take out this general, if you can. I'd really like it if you could, but no, 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 take the general. General. There we go. If this is the commanding general, that is fantastic. But I doubt it. I think that one's the commanding general. No, 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 no. Ah, sod it. Get back over here. Let's see if we can't uh, trick them. Get them to chase our cavalry while we murder them. You can fire at will again. I doubt that we'll be facing anything over that way. Where are you? Ah, okay. Libyan Cav, get over here. I'm just going to form up all of our cavalry into one big group. And we're going to avoid entangling ourselves with their skirmisher cav. Because that would be the definition of a bad plan. These are sturdy, they're going to turn around. And cavalry, I need you to stand over here. Ish. also require these fellows. It looks like the majority of their army is retreating. I could be wrong about that. Okay, General Cav, Heavy Cav, no idea. Charge their General. This ought to be good. No, get off that defensive mode bullshit. Attack! Nice. Ready, wavering, shaken. Oh, come on, get them before the Libyan pikes show up. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Well, maybe the Libyan pikes will stay away a little bit. They appear to be. General is slain, and now his men Good. fear us. Good. Cavalry, peel off. The <laughs> there we go. We did it right this time. Alright, Cavalry, I need you to go over this way just in case these guys get any fancy ideas about attacking our, um, our infantry over there. 
That means you run. Just FYI. Okay. Need you, gentlemen, to run. You need to be up here. You need to be threatening those Libyan, uh, those Libyan pikes. You guys need to charge. And you need to run in there and hit them. Some of us are winded, some of us are exhausted. We're basically just going to have to do the best we can. Is that a general? That is a general. Get over here. If you can tangle them up in combat, I would be awfully grateful. It's not going to happen. But we are hitting the Libyans and the Mashamoy guys in the back, so that is a plus. They're still routing. Okay. Let's see if we can't get these bastards. If we can encircle them enough, they won't be able to run. Yep, now they're confused. They just can't run. Now they're stuck in combat. Hello. Wavering, shaken, blah. Wavering, shaken, broken. That's the way you do it. Okay. Now we just have to worry about these gentlemen. I'd like you guys to form a block over here, please. Really? Who are you being attacked by? Oh, right. Now it's time for what's left of the cavalry to get over here, and these infantry to get over there at the double, please. This is going to be fun. Need you guys to line up right there, so you can all get good shots. 157 of them, 240 of them. If we hit them hard enough in the back, we might win. Problem being that because we are pincering them, if they decide to chase after one force, the secondary force, or the one that they don't engage, might not be able to get there in time. So far though, it looks like they're trying to go round us. Or they're just standing there, doing god knows what. Alright, you can withdraw, you can withdraw. You can just do what you think best. Stand here-ish. A little bit further back. Alright, there we go. Damn. Oh, we chewed these bastards up, so that's something. Cavalry is coming in on the side. Bear in mind also that we were outnumbered, so we've done pretty well. We've only lost 20% of our force. That's pretty good. Nice. Yep. That's the general idea. You guys are going to march like that, and I'm going to have the regular infantry over here, just wheel. Cavalry. Your job is going to just be to mop up survivors. Pretty much. So, it would seem that these Libyan cavalry, while they are, f they are brilliant on the charge, they're not particularly strong. They, uh, they've got fairly weak morale. You can run too, seeing as you're out of ammo. Oh shit, did I just send them running into the... Okay, no. These guys are just sort of standing here. Alright, well, looks like we got one more fight to go after we, um... We get rid of these guys, but that's okay. We can deal with that. 
Let us speed up time a little bit. See where these guys go. Because if they try to march right into that gap, we can do this. Charge. 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 Now you have to choose which way you're going to turn. This is the worst thing that can possibly happen to a phalanx. You get smacked on two sides, you aren't coming out of that one. Now we don't want to make them fight to the death. No, 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 no. We want to let them get away a little bit. them down. You guys need to get over there. Nice. Alright. Actually, you guys are fresh, aren't you? Run over there and annoy them. Alright. And control group number two, you need to be in control group number one, and you need to march like a soap. Actually, cavalry, you guys can mop these fellas up. Might need these uh, pop lights for later. Oh no, there they go. Oh no, those are our guys. <laughs> I thought they were uh, the enemy running away for a minute there. I was like, aha! They've decided to give it up. Nope. No, nope, they're just repositioning. Okay. Well, let's get over there. I'll speed up time again. So hopefully this won't take too long. To get over there but this is what I love about the Total War series is that there's like that epic feel of battles and sadly Rome 2 just hasn't managed to capture that same feel for me it's just it, I don't know what it's done wrong apart from just be so bizarrely broken and yeah just just bad really it was not what I was expecting from uh, the sequel to Rome 1 but some of that, I suppose, is down to the hype that fans of uh, Rome Total War had. They were all thinking, oh, well, when they remake it, it'll be brilliant, it'll be the best thing ever. And then it wasn't, really. But what can you do? Okay, so what do we got here? We got some Peltasts, Libyans, Pezoi, Persian Phalanx, Mercenary Hoplites. Alright. We'll wait for them to come to us. We need to uh, flank them. The gentlemen need to run a little faster. And you guys need to get here on the flank. Like that. Hmm. These guys are going to be the problem. Yeah, you'd think that the phalanxes would be the problem. You know, seeing as cavalry is pretty much useless against them. But no. Nope. The problem is these guys, because they have arrows, well, javelins, close enough. Now let's make them choose again, which way they're going to face. You hit them, you hit them, you hit them. There we go, shaken. Alright, cavalry, I need you guys wheel around this way. Alright, there we go. Doing a good job. Doing a good job. Broken. Brilliant. Just made it the loss of the battle. That's damn right. Now these calves, they're going to go around and they are going to wipe out those peltasts. Everybody just attack. Uh, actually, you will detach. Attack these gentlemen. You are going this way. Hell no. No, no, no. Keep running. running from our men. Keep running this way. I need you to attack these actual guys. What the 
hell are you doing, Equites? I have no idea what half these units are trying to do there, but it's not what I asked them to do. Alright. Kill. Oh, Equites. Sploosh. Alright, let's kill them all. So we lost 23% of our force for 95% of theirs. Just about. Pretty good trade. Excellent work. Excellent work. You've clearly won the battle. Indeed we have. We lost about 400 men. Not bad. Well, a little bit over 400. But we killed every single one of them, essentially. Wow. Those Astarte that got mauled got 44 of their men back. That's, that's pretty good. Cavalry, not so much. Yeah, I'm just going to combine the remaining Libyan Cav into one unit, and we'll just have three units of cavalry. Not really a whole lot we can do about that. Victory! Yeah, Carthage did what I thought they were going to do. But they bypassed Genoa, which is interesting. Hmm. Alright, need you to drop them off there. No, you can't quite make it. Okay. Hopefully you can make it next turn. Well, on the plus side, they can grab those units. Uh, slingers? Any slingers? No. Alright, next turn, Tertius can do that, and this is the fleet. Okay, it got hit hard. Can we hit it harder? Yes. Kill. No fleet for you. Uh-oh. <laughs> Might be no fleet for us as well. Uh, hopefully not. Okay, so let's have a look. Enemy army routes. Good, they are so few in number. Blah de blah de blah. We still have to kill the one guy that's sitting in there. Fantastic. Okay. Combine. At least they kept the experience chevron. Well, that's not too bad. That's pretty good, actually. We did fairly well, I think, with that battle. All things considered. And Cassius Helvius Sinner. It's pretty much no longer needed down here. I might move this fleet to Athens. And then he can go and attack Crete. Actually, no. First he's going to go get these guys retrained and pick up some more infantry. One turn until this is done. Orders. Yeah, let's just march back over Forward. here. This guy, he's not a threat. He can't do shit. And you... General. You, sir. Attack. The oh, the gates are open. Sir. Well, that's nice, but we don't need them. We're not, we're not going to uh, launch an assault in there. I'm not that stupid. Ooh, Sarmatians. Yes, please. And Thracian Slingers, yes. Um, these guys were really, really good bastard, eh? But we can only get one unit max. Nah, not worth it. Those guys are best used in multiple attack, uh, in multiple swarms. So the Republic of Carthage is now at war with the Republic of Rome. Saw that one coming, it's what they do now. They might have the manpower to overwhelm Malta, but Augustus is on the way. So even if they take it, we'll just take it back. Doesn't look like they have any more navies, but I could just be missing some. You are pretty much not helping me down there, so you're going to swap places with Oppius. You're going to head over here. Oppius is going to head over here, and you are going to head down here. Okay, so 
They pretty much got nothing that can attack me. Nothing dangerous, I should say. Settlement besieged, yeah, Malta, I know. Goals. End of turn. We lost a bit of money, but meh. Greek logic, the theories of Plato and Aristotle, would have been synthesized into a new system of thought called logic, a philosophy concerned with the principle of reasoning in arguments. As a tool of rational thought, logic allows philosophers to discuss and test ideas with a new and revolutionary thoroughness. Huh. We are the most advanced faction. And Herius Calvinus Sabinus now has Calvisius? Calvisius Sabinus now has a heroic savior. Good job you. Did he get a uh, good No, apparently not. I was hoping he'd get a, uh, a good defender trait or something like that, but he did give us a kid, so that's that's a plus. I forgive him. Rome has recruited some soldiers. Thessalonica has recruited a trireme. And spies. Spies everywhere. So what are you doing? You're no Hannibal. Wow. Really? You actually marched in here. Ooh, what are these? Iberian spearmen are heavy infantry, much like the Scutarii. They are armed with a spear, breastplate, and Celtic shield similar to the Roman Scutum. Ooh. Uh, you're the Poeni. Have you got any of those Scutari? Scutari Falcata? Ooh. They're referred to as Scutarii by, uh, by the Romans because of the large oval shields. And armed with heavy javelins as well as swords, they fight by bombarding the enemy and then closing to fight hand to hand in a similar way to Roman legionaries. Spain might be a spot to go conquer, but it would be very difficult. I like it. Alright, you, can you find out for me about this man? He's a good commander, sober, proud, and a night, a night fighter. But he doesn't have any reinforcements coming. So our column, under Appius Fabius Maximus, should be able to whip him. Let's trap him, so he can't go forward, but he can't go back. Not really. Uh, no, you don't need to build anything. Hmm. Finally, provincial barracks have been built at Antigonia. Good. Good, good, good. Which means we can retrain some of our most veteran soldiers. I forgot that these guys were here. We may have to send them on a boat. Philippi has Roman Auxilia Phase 2. Phase three give you anything cool? Uh, slingers? Yeah, they're all right. Corinth has a temple. Thessalonica has a phase two auxilia. But it requires a hippodrome before we can actually build anything better than that. So go with the temples for now. Make sure everyone knows that they are Roman. Roman. All right, you're besieging that. You are just, I, I don't even know. Um, there's not a whole heap we need to do right now. Really? I wonder. Can I be of service? I Hello? Do you guys trade maps? No, no, that's not what I want. Oh. God damn it. I want maps for maps. Wow. Thrace is just like a powerhouse right now. Huh. That's interesting. Um, we need a diplomat over near Spain, which means you get to recruit me one. Okay. All right, that's a good start. That's a very good start. Alright, well, I'm going to take a bit of a break. Ooh. Ooh, excuse me. And uh, when we come back, Carthage must fall. <laughs> that's, that's pretty much the up and down of it. Carthage must fall. So I'm sure some of you will be happy about that.
<laughs> Thank you for watching, Grey Hunter signing out.